Good morning to you. Take a look here. Low pressure is moving through California and the northern portion of the state. And we have the cold front associated with that going out of California, coming right back. But it did drop some snow in the Sierra Nevada mountains and continues to do so. We'll see more of that activity continue as showers passing down along north to south along the coast. Brought us some good thunderstorm activity today. Those isolated thunderstorms will continue as you go along. You'll see uh, it'll begin to lift out of the area in the afternoon. But as we go into Friday, uh, we'll see eventually a little bit more of this activity come right back into the area again for Friday morning. And then you can also see the Friday afternoon. It'll still hold on just a wee bit. Then the temperatures will start to increase in size as high pressure builds Saturday into Sunday. And then, of course, there's another line of uh, thunderstorm activity trying to make it back along the coast. And it'll hit this high pressure ridge out of the area, kind of cool things down Monday a little bit. And then another ridge begins to build as you go into the uh, afternoon for Monday. And then Tuesday, we could see some of this bring in some uh, rainfall for us on Tuesday night into Wednesday. We'll see at least um, about half an inch of rainfall in the next 48 hours here back again. And then also, you're going to see uh, mostly cloudy skies with a chance of thunderstorm activity holding onto the area. Isolated thunderstorms not out of the question in the early morning, and then we taper it by the afternoon. Temperatures will be in the 60s from the Bay Area all the way back down to the South Bay. You get into Hollister around 62. Salinas shows up at 62, getting to 64 in King City. Over on the peninsula, we'll see temperatures in the low 60s and then more of the same as you go into uh, the area of the Boulder Creek uh, parts of the Santa Cruz Mountains, Los Gatos Hills, getting into Santa Cruz, 61 degrees, 60 in Watsonville. Your seven day forecast taking you right into temperatures around 55 to 64. Chance of rainfall returns Friday early morning and then it tapers as we go into the afternoon. But then the line of thunderstorm activity possible comes in as a cold front moves right back in. It'll be mostly to the North Bay and the San Francisco Bay Area. Then we go into Saturday, Sunday, we dry out a bit. We warm up the temperatures well above normal. Monday and Tuesday, 74 degrees. And then right back into Tuesday night, we could see rainfall coming in into uh, early Wednesday morning.